Hi everyone, uh, this is John. I uh, thought I'd give you a camera view of how I normally work on my boards. Now I'm, uh, what you're seeing is direct from the Anastar ADS-M201. I normally am looking at it on a 24 inch monitor in front of me and I believe it looks similar to what you're seeing. Um, what I do is um, I build these boards um, and I use the Anastar to inspect them. Uh, I use a um, solder paste and reflow oven for all these service mount components. Um, so, and then all the through hole component, most of the through hole components, I use a wave soldering. To, actually, it's called dip soldering. Um, I can use my polarization control on my Anastar to check. Uh, chip lettering, make sure everything's right, as opposed to when you have a high reflection, sometimes it's hard to read the chips, but with the polarization control you can bring the text right on out. Um, I, uh, I do uh, the wave, the dip soldering, except there are a few items that I don't do, and this is one of them. This is a tiny, tiny pitch um, connector. So it's nice to use my magnifier, well, the uh, microscope, to also push that in. Now, a nice thing about the depth of field of the NSTAR is I can sit here and have it at a 45 degree angle, and I can inspect all of the solder joints from the dip soldering. And occasionally, for some reason my screen just went black, um, occasionally there's a bridge in dip soldering. And that's why I don't dip solder these tiny pitch things, because it, it bridges quite a bit. But I can bring in my iron and just clean up this bridge. All I have to do is swipe it, swipe it loose. All right, having a little trouble there. There. No longer bridged. And I'll go ahead and solder these. I'm actually looking at the tiny screen on the Anon Star right now. Normally I would be looking on my 24 inch monitor, uh, but I'm looking on the tiny screen and doing this soldering uh, because it won't output the HDMI at the same time you're recording video. So that's one thing. Okay, that guy is done. Well, that one's a little bit cold. Alright, so that's an overview of how you can inspect your solder joints. I'm glad I have my dip soldering station, and I'm glad I have a pick and place machine. Yeah, lucky me. And reflow oven. So 99% of this board is done with those two methods. Anyway, um, hope you enjoyed this. Um, that's uh, how I use the Anon Star. Oh, and there's one other thing that I wanted to say. There's There was a person that was complaining to me that the Anon Star is not putting out uh, true high definition um, 1080p video, but it is. Even though your monitor reports there's something less than 1080p, it is 1080p. How do I know that? Because my monitor reports that I'm 640 by 480 when I'm plugged into the HDMI. But um, the video that I am recording right here in HDMI at 1080p um, looks the same on my monitor as it does um, when I view it on my computer when I'm preparing to upload it for, for YouTube. So it is truly um, 
high definition. No question about it. All right, hope you enjoyed. Thank you.